a fundamental shift in the way we're starting to produce our airplanes. To move the production system forward to where we need it to be, you really got to start bringing in the modern tools. Boeing is taking some of the elbow grease out of finishing an airplane and is turning to robots. They've invented an automated system that does everything from priming to cleaning to painting the wings. All right, I'm ready to see these robots in action. All right, let's step to the other end of the booth and turn them on. All right. Eric, you going to refire? I'm resetting uh, the doors now. So what is the secret sauce of these robots here? They'll do the finishes much faster and much more consistent than most of the painters collectively. It's a very difficult to achieve when you're spraying gray for four and a half hours. The, the robots, robots are okay it. with it. They don't get hypnotized. They can work in the dark right. as well. And they don't need bathroom breaks. The robotic system has consolidated their painting facilities from three to one, and the new room has some high-tech upgrades. We designed a movable roof. It's one roof shared with two booths so that they're always working as much as possible. There's another booth on the other side, and this same robot works on both, both oh, wings. So the, so the track goes on the track to the other side. The real gain in the weight savings is with the airline. You're saving 80 pounds over 20 years. What is that? It varies based on fuel costs, but it's millions of dollars. Boeing's push towards automation also includes several robotic drilling machines. So right now, this technology is only being implemented with the 777. Do you foresee that changing in the near future? I think it's going to dramatically improve the cost of producing airplanes when you start looking at the 737. Even extension into 47 with certain applications, you're going to see the, some of these technologies get applied. How much are you saving right now using the automated spray method and using the flex track driller? We're, we're seeing, you know, 10, 20, 30 percent improvements depending on the technology. Am I ever going to be flying in an airplane that is made completely by robots? The answer is yes. Probably within the next decade or so, you'll have a highly constructed airplane.